Russian lady ever to win the British Open, the most prestigious title on the PSA World Tour. Urgency in the movement of Nick Matthew. He, he knows exactly how dangerous Ashore is. Oh, he's done it. Well, look at the fist there from Matthew. That was a massive, massive opening game from the Englishman. Yep. Oh, great rally. What a response from Nick Matthew here. Just when he looked as though Ashore was building and up a out. lead. Some of the movement there from Wilstrop and take nothing away from Remy Ashore, but he does look pretty heavy in the legs. The Yorkshireman. It's obviously understandable, but that match last night, Joey, an hour and, hour and a half of scintillating squash. It's got to take it out of the system. This is unbelievable squash from Romeo Shaw. You just cannot explain what he's doing here. Well, Will Shop just peeling this. Oh, that is. Well, not yet. The movement of a Shaw going two footed in, but improvising the straight drive. Well, look at it there. Body language of Will Shop here, though, as he comes out. And there's the error. So Rami Ashour closes out a high quality second semi final. You can see the uh, eyes. He's so, so happy to reach his second final of this British Open, two years running. A lot of respect for a very war weary opponent in James Wollstrop. Oh, this is. Absolutely amazing. She's using such good skill. The confidence really starting to exude out of Laura Mazzaro. And what must be going through Laura Mazzaro's mind right now? Oh, she's done it! She's done it! Absolutely amazing. Laura Mazzaro is the first English lady since Lisa Opie back in 1991 to win the prestigious British Open. What a steely performance by the world number two. Thoroughly deserved. And I hope there's floods and floods of tears because she is quite extraordinary. A fantastic display of squash from both ladies. There's Danny Mazzaro, her husband. Oh. Can you only imagine what she's feeling right now? shows how important that was to her as she takes that final game 11-8 and just look at this 
Laura Massaro's face just says it all. The intensity of those last points was just extraordinary. 3-1 against the defending champion, and it was not easy. Laura Massaro took the first game 11-8. Then Nicole David came back 11-5, 11-7, 11-8, and she is the champion. The R2014 champion representing Malaysia, Nicole David. marched to five game balls. Ah! Well, it's another backhand, very fitting and for Sam. Yeah! Well, she's done it, she's done it. Yeah! Camille Sam yeah! is the yeah! LM British yeah! Open 2015 yeah! champion. 11-3, What a performance from Camille Cern. Takes the match 3-1 in 51 minutes. 11-3, 11-5, 8-11, 11-8. champion Camille Sern. Well that was a, a little bit of a miss hit but uh, she'll take it. That looked out of court. That looked out of court. She's finished it anyway. Shabini has made history here in Hull. 11, 7, 9, 11, the first 11, Egyptian 11, 6, lady 11, ever to win the British Open. And what a way to do it. Just 20 years of age. One month older than the great Susan Devoy. Seventy-five minute marathon, it's Shabini that manages to hold on, taking down Narong Gohar, the number eight seed, three games to two. And the 2016 Alam British Open ladies champion from Egypt, Noor El Shabini. This is a very positive start from Gaultier. Matthew starting to look a little bit more ragged. Well, that was such a, a late flick here. He's got so much time, of course, Gaultier. And... Gaultier's done it. He's won the British Open for the third time. He's also now become the new world number one in the April rankings. The oldest number one ever to grace the PSA World Tour. 34 years of age and three months. What an impressive bit of squash. Consistent squash from Gregory Gaultier over this 2017 season so far. 
massive, massive rivalry and respect. Nick Matthew tried absolutely everything. He had an immense tournament, Matthew. Yeah, it's, uh, it's a fine line, really, for Sarah Jane Perry. She's an attacking player, and when she's playing really well, the winners just don't stop coming. But uh, she's got a very difficult opponent today in Laura Massaro. Oh. Uh, it's a very important volley drop, and you can see what it means to Laura Massaro. Both of these ladies breathing so heavily. This match ball, British Open. Perry fighting for her life here. Down. Well, she's hit the error. Can the error for Sarah Jane Perry has handed the title to eliminate. Laura Massaro. Six, eleven, eleven, six. Sarah Jane Perry coming so close, had a magnificent tournament herself, but Massaro takes her second title here at the Alam British Open in 2017. Incredible achievement by Laura Massaro, who's just taking it all in at the moment. Wonderful scenes, a wonderful achievement for Laura Massaro. Two very proud men here. Yeah, well, they'll be chuffed a bit for Laura Massaro. and Jan Shikhan wore it and uh, yeah, it wasn't the, uh, the most stylish. No, it wasn't. Oh. Great reactions from Matthew. Oh, oh my goodness me. Oh, oh wow. <laughs> almost got it. He almost got it. The, uh, the wrist of Kandra. That was a very strange Six, shot. Eight. Still back Kandra at this point. Don't think he's uh, the kind of guy to, to uh, bottle it. I think Nick Matthew's going to have to win it if it happens. Oh, oh, oh he's done it. He's Kandra's done it. Done what it. a win. Kandra's done it. So Raphael Kandra, who's had a dream okay. event, but he's deserved everything that's gone on. Getting through two rounds 11, of qualification, 11, beating 11, Yip from Hong Kong along the way. Then Castanier in the first round. Now he's beaten the great Nick Matthew. Good width, very good width. Solid dodgy pickup. Well, oh. that is unbelievable strength. He's in. Oh, oh wow. wow! Wow! There's the head nod. The awareness was fantastic, and he was on to the ball so early here, Kandra. That is super. It is. Look at the, <laughs> look at the pick up 90. from the Jackal. Oh, my oh, goodness. What a dig. What a dig. This is unbelievable oh, wow. from Kandra. What a rally. Listen to that. Wow. Listen to that roar. That's the loudest roar we've had all day. Crowd absolutely what loving this battle. Unbelievable from Kandra. How he got that back. Their huge split step jump. Do you see that? History being made once again at the most prestigious event on the calendar. Possibly. I'll speak too soon. Wow. He's going to do it. Wow. He's done it! 
Sarri has done it. It's oh, amazing. What a cheer that was. It's amazing. He finally <laughs> collapses. I mean, he's charged around. He thoroughly deserves it. Very gracious of Marwan. Very gracious. Look at that. It's, a good, know, it's good to see. Very good very to see. Very good to see from the Jackal there. But wow, Kandra, they're all standing up filming. New legend, mate. What a legend. He's had a result and a result. Look at him. <laughs> Turning into a bit of a superstar, this young man. This is an excellent rally for the Cannonball. And there, the oh, wow. Oh, he's got it. He's got it. Oh, oh my God. Oh, yes. Get <laughs> oh, the crowd going. That, that lady, lady can't believe, can't believe it. it. <laughs> she nearly threw a drink over her husband. Back oh, up, and then the get here. Shabagi cannot believe it. It's well, he didn't brilliant. think he was going to go over the 10, did he? Oh. The second one. Thank the you. dive here, look at this. How <laughs> on earth did he get that back? <laughs> and then oh. the dexterity to play a, a reverse angle. How does he do it? <laughs> Still moving so well, the Colombian. Doesn't seem to be any fatigue in his body. Well, he's appealed that. He's, he's given it. Oh, it. Oh, my God. Rodriguez has done it! I can't believe it! He's made history! Here at the finish line, the Colombian cannonball is going to be down in the history books. The first South American ever to win the British Open. Marvin El Shabagi played an epic battle. I mean, the courage of Shabagi. And look at this, it's fantastic from El Shabagi. Consoling, uh, kind of consoling. The yeah. winner, in a way. The Shabagi brothers are very, very good in defeat, I have to say. This is very, it's very, very, good, very good of him here. This is fantastic. So, Rodriguez, the cannonball, unseeded, he wins the British Open. Yeah. <laughs> he wins the British Open. What a story, Joey. Oh, you can't, you can't write it.